Alright folks, welcome back to another set of Dungeons of Dreadmore with me, your host, Emerald Dragon. Um, so after the screw up the last time, I've reinstalled the game. Hopefully everything will work out. I am quietly optimistic, but we'll have to wait and see how things turn out, won't we? There we go, just get our loot fist cube open, and let's head down, yet again, to level two. And straight away we've got a nice little trap, and someone that wants to get smacked in the face. And of course, for the moment, we're not one-hit killing things. That will hopefully change. And of course we're not running into a lot of animals at the moment. Um, no, don't attempt to fix that just yet. We'll eat this plum. And now we'll give it a shot. to regain health. Exactly what I figured would happen. But we had to attempt it. Aqua Fortis? No, I don't need that. Actually, what was it that I just put in? I think that was salt, Peter. I wasn't even focusing on what I put in. Um, if it was salt, Peter, that was a very bad thing for me to do. See if we just move back here, we can take on this toxic lobby. Your life force is running out. And we'll just eat a bit of tofu. And this mummy will come over to us so we can smack her here. Now we gotta wait out the little poison gas. And see what else was in here. Fortis. Got a trap. Ooh, gloves. Do we have gloves? Yes, we have gloves. Let's see, emeralds don't really sell for much. Sweet acid bottle bolts. Okay, let's. Ooh, excellent. We got into close combat with him. Easy enough. That looks nice. I mean, that gives us some sagacity, gives us decent defense. Hmm. Yeah, it's an improvement over this. So that's pretty excellent. Now we've got the Electro Blobby to take care of. Getting very close to that next level up. And this might do it. Sweet. Okay, so what I'm going to do is... <coughs> what will I do? I think... I shall move along the uh, burglary skill tree for the moment because I want this five finger discount. It'll help get the most out of Brax shops. And then I will start going along the veganism skill tree. At least for one or two levels. Might pick up other stuff along the way, not too sure yet. Some nice throwing weapons. Oil of vitriol. 
Get some food. Ooh, loot fisk. Loot fisk. Yeah, we can eat that. We can eat that. So we're doing okay. Picking up a few bits and pieces. We'll probably... I uh, don't think I need chalk. Right. Lootfisk. Chalk. I'm fairly certain I don't need chalk. I'm gonna have to keep a hold of saltpeter, though. Saltpeter, rust, aquavitae, um... think Ascidium. Hold on, I'm gonna go check. Okay, it seems that I was slightly wrong. I need oil of vitriol and not anything else. Unf unfortunately, I had an oil of vitriol and then before I realized it, I turned it to loot fisk. So I'm going to have to be a little bit more careful about that. See, there's some nice looking stuff in here. Nice ring. Got some parachute pants. Perfect because it gives you 10 dodge. Got that vampire hunter's hat, which would be brilliant. Ooh, sweet thieving gloves. I'm just gonna buy them. Because it might take me forever to find them out in the wild. And Brax, you can have these. So yeah, what I'm gonna need to do is stock up on pretty much every bit of rust, saltpeter, oil of vitriol, and aquavitae that I come across. Let's see, carnelian, and that. And over here, there are these diggles that I can't really kill anyway. Well, I guess we know what we're doing. Use this lever. We'll get this. Do that. Open up the inventory. And this belongs in the museum. Ooh, I'm actually going to have to do it for that too. Completely forgot that that was an item. Well, wow, I got no experience for that other thing. Let's see how much experience. 120. Not a lot. Now we've got a couple of diggles running around. Not much we can do about that. Unfortunately. At least there's always these fellas. Death is too scary. Let's see, Grog and a fairy wedger. Not having too much trouble getting around. At least not yet. Unfortunately, we've got to deal with a load of these Your things. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to. What is that? Oh, the minus one health. Uh, eat that. Put these in here. Possibly eat that as well. Before I attempt to look into this, because it could be acid. No, I got moisture. Which, you know, really works out well because that's like healing. Toxic body. Critical hits. Ectoplasmic guys again. That little 
shit sitting over there in the corner just blasting away at me. You would have to fly off. Okay. Don't need black powder. Get some traps. And this one. Okay, now it opens something somewhere. Not sure where. I think it's just through here that it opens. Or maybe not. Critical hit. Hmm. To not too happy Critical about how hit. things are going. I mean, I'm not doing too bad, but I am losing a bit of health along the way. This might be worth putting on after a while, but only after I start getting some extra nimbleness. I mean, it takes two off. By the end of this, I'd like to be able to get to a stage where nothing can touch me. That's the whole point of going nimbleness, it's just... You can dance around wherever the hell you want and nothing can lay a finger on you. Will the plan work out? I don't think there's really any way of telling. But we're going to give it a shot. Uh, doesn't sell well, I don't think. Better pick up a bunch of diggle eggs. Sewer brew isn't useful to me. Out of the way. I don't think I can turn that into anything with the port still. Uh, softballs. I'm gonna keep a hold of most throwing weapons just to use on these guys if they're part of quests. case I'm gonna have to come back for that uber chest whenever I find the corresponding um, switch to open it. Some heroic vandalism? heroic vandalism? Sweet. Now I gotta wait around for this guy to move so I can get out. I'm gonna keep a hold of that. It seems to have a lot of the same resistances as the other one I found, only with minus one to nimbleness instead of minus two. So I might end up using it, might not, I just gotta kind of wait and see how it turns out. Now yeah, makeshift bombs, got a wand, I think it's only worth a couple of hundred. Pick some cheese. I mean, the one really good thing about the current skill set I'm using is that pretty much everything can go in to become loot fisk. And then I got free stuff from those. There's nothing in there. And up here we've got nothing. Okay. Let's see. One blobby down. 